everyone so today I'm gonna to be doing what's in my school bag this was a request when I did what's in my makeup bag like what I take to school so I thought I would do this so this has nothing to do with makeup or beauty related so um, it's alright if you don't want to watch this but I'm gonna show um, what's in my school bag for those who uh, wanted this video so I'm gonna show you it's really heavy <laughs> but it looks like this and it's from Abercrombie and Fitch I've had this probably since 7th grade, so it's really old and probably faded and stuff, but it still works and it's really heavy duty, so, yeah. And I already showed you what's in my makeup bag, and you can uh, go watch that video if you're wondering, and I'll link it down below if, if you can't find it for some reason. And then also, I just take my satchel because this has, like, um, my school ID, my ID, um, money for lunch or anything in here so I can just take this instead of taking like my jacket with my money in it or something or I just have like this so I have everything in it um, that I need if I want to go out to eat with my friends or something or for a game I can just throw that over my shoulder. Then I have my Columbia in here because it's been really cold in the morning and I just throw it on and then take it off when I get to school or whatever. So I just have that in there because I get cold. And then next kind of boring stuff is the school stuff. So let's see. So I have like a big pocket here and then a little pocket here. So I'll show you what's in the little pocket first. I have a random highlighter, an orange one. And then I have note cards and this is for French. Like I have classroom phrases and then I have numbers in French just so I can study and then I have lots of pens I have Starburst wrapper and then I just have a pen and then I have another sharpie it's a sharpie highlighter please that's a blue one and then I have random hair tie two pens and if you're wondering, these do not write pink or purple, they're just black. I thought that they would write pink and purple, but they don't, so sad. And then I have a yellow one, and then a green one, and then I have just two pencils. And these are mechanical. I love mechanical, and I think they're .7, yeah. So I love those. And if you're wondering why I have so many highlighters, I love to highlight and just like... For notes or missing assignments or things that I need to do, I just like to highlight. So when I find a highlighter and start highlighting, I go crazy. And then I have the Sally Hansen lip gloss, and this is Toasted of the Town. I have this actually on right now. And then I have hand sanitizer, and this is like a must-have. I think hand sanitizer is very important. I keep it in my makeup bag and also in my bag. Um, in my purse everywhere because I think it's very good to have nice clean hands um, even if like the bathroom doesn't have soap just in case you have hand sanitizer and then if you for some reason do in class and the teacher doesn't let you go wash your hands and you, your hands just feel gross that's always good at least um, it cleans a little bit I mean I know soap and water is a little bit better but it works Okay, now, and then I have my EOS, and this is the yellow one. I think this one's Lemon Drop. It doesn't, the name thing fell off, but it smells like lemons, so. I don't know the name, but it's very, it smelled good. And then I have two more pencils. These two. And these are for uh, interior design. They, like, are special pencils that you write on tracing papers, so I just have those. And then I have Hollister Body Spray. I hate smelling like really gross or like B.O. or like outside the smell. So I always like to keep perfume with me just in case like I just need a refresh. So. And then I just have my math book. And this is Geometry. And let's see. The bottom of my bag here has more pencils. I always wonder, like, why? where does all my pencils go? 
I think they come at, they collect at the bottom of my bag. And then I have binders. And these ones I got from Walmart. Cute floral uh, flower ones. I have one for math and then I have one for French. And this just has all my homework and stuff in it. Um, and then I have another binder, but I guess I didn't bring it home tonight. I guess I left it in my locker, but it has all my other classes in it. And then I have just a spiral notebook for notes that's pink. And I have another one. This one's for math. And I just got all my school supplies from Walmart and a little bit of Fred Meyers, but I think that's it. And then, let's see. I have these little folders. And one is for like a missing ass assignments or like things I need to redo to get a better score on or like homework or anything. I'm not going to show you like what's inside, but um, I just keep these. So normally I just take these two home so then I don't have to take my binders so my bag's not as heavy. Um, but for some reason I brought it all home. Luckily I did so I can do this video. But um, And then the next one I just have like assignments that I that are not due for a really long time. So that I already have done. So I just keep them in there. Then I just have extra graph paper and paper. I use a lot of paper. <laughs> and then the last thing I have is my reading book. And this is a summer book and I know I'm probably late on reading this because everyone else has read this probably already on YouTube because um, a lot of people recommended this but it's a summer I turned pretty and I think it's still a good book even if it's not summertime. Um, it's definitely a good read. I am halfway through it. I'm actually reading it um, for silent reading in language arts right now so I don't read on my own time um, that often. I have another book, but I am um, really enjoying this book. It is really good and it's kind of sad at the same time, like some parts. I'm um, not going to tell you, but I think it's really cute. A cute kind of love story, beach story. Um, I can't say much about it because I don't want to ruin it, but um, it's really a good book. <laughs> And then, at the bottom, I just have trash and another pen. But, um, that's it. It's empty. But, um, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I hope I didn't bore you guys too much. I know last time I did this, people thought it was really boring. Um, so, I didn't go that much into it, but I showed what I have in it, in my bag. So, for those who wanted, I hope you guys enjoyed, and leave me your request down below um, in the comments or comments or like on my page or somewhere so I can uh, do more videos. And I hope you guys are all doing great, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.